evening and welcome to Night Tree, which is going to be taken from our home worship book that's starting on page nine. O oh God, make speed to save us. O oh Lord, make haste to help us. Reveal among us the light of your presence, that we may behold your power and glory. Blessed are you, sovereign God, creator of light and darkness, to you be glory and praise forever. As evening falls, you and you, your promise to reveal among us the light of your presence. May your word be a lantern to our feet and a light upon our path, that we may behold your coming among us. Strengthen us in our stumbling weakness and free our tongues to sing your praise. Blessed be God, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, blessed be God forever, that this evening may be holy, good and peaceful. Let us pray with one heart and mind. As our evening prayer rises before you, O God, so may your mercy come down upon us to cleanse our hearts and set us free to sing your praise now and forever. Amen. So the psalm is 49. Hear this, all you peoples. Listen, all you that dwell in the world. You of low or high degree, both rich and poor together. My mouth shall speak of wisdom and my heart shall meditate on understanding. I will incline my ear to a parable. I will unfold my riddle with the lie. Why should I fear in evil days when the malice of my foes surround me, such as trust in their goods and glory in the abundance of their riches? For no one can indeed ransom another or pay to God the price of deliverance. To ransom a soul is too costly. There is no price one could pay for it so that they might live forever and never see the grave. For we see that the wise die also, with the foolish and ignorant they perish, and leave their riches to others. Their tomb is their home forever, their dwelling through all generations, though they call their lands after their own names. Lift up your voice with strength, O herald of good tidings. My soul proclaims the greatness of the Lord. My spirit rejoices in God, my Saviour. He has looked with favour on his lowly servant. From this day all generations will call me blessed. The Almighty has done great things for me, and holy is his name. He has mercy on those who fear him, from generation to generation. He has shown strength with his arm, and has scattered the proud in their conceit casting down the mighty from their thrones and lifting up the lowly. He has filled the hungry with good things and sent the rich away empty. He has come to the aid of his servant Israel to remember his promise of mercy, the promise made to our ancestors, to Abraham and his children forever. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and shall be forever. Amen. Lift up your voice with strength, O herald of good tidings. And let's pray together. Father God, we thank you for this day and for the encounters that we have had. We pray that you would bless all those that we have met or spoke with today and that you would grant them peace this night. We continue to pray for all of the work in regards to COVID at this time, for all of the healthcare professionals and those supporting people who are vulnerable and in need. Grant them wisdom in their decisions, strength in their actions and peace in their minds. Amen. Almighty God, give us grace to cast away the works of darkness and to put on the armour of light, now in the time of this mortal life, 
in which your son Jesus Christ came to us in great humility. But on the last day when he shall come again in his glorious majesty to judge the living and the dead, we may rise to the life immortal through him who is alive and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God now and forever. Amen. Awaiting his coming in glory as our Saviour taught us, so we pray. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power and the glory are yours now and forever. Amen. May the Lord, when he comes, find us watching and waiting.